Gabriel Bijirimana prunes his Arabica coffee trees after a bumper harvest. His three-acre coffee plantation of 1,800 trees is located in Rambura village, Nyakawa and sub-county, Kisoro district. Bijirimana is a member of the Gorilla Highland Coffee, a 2,500 member association of coffee farmers, mainly youths in Kisoro Highlands, who dedicatedly practice good agronomics and pull together their coffee and process it, targeting the high-end strategic coffee market, a process called specialty marketing. We are targeting specialty niche. Specialty niche, this is a, a new niche uh, where people pay a lot of price for the best coffee, the best coffee. So uh, we target specialty niche. Uh, we, we have a contact office in Australia, in Brisbane. We have uh, an office in Tokyo, Japan. We have an office in Dublin, Ireland, and in Detroit, Michigan, uh, where we are targeting actually the, the black community. Gorilla Highland Coffee is one of the youths run small businesses that are being supported through an incubation program run by the Uganda Coffee Development Authority and Makero University Agricultural Research Institute, Kabanyoro. The incubation offers roasting facilities and training which would allow them to be export ready. Each kilogram sold as roasted and packaged coffee fetches the farmer 12,000 US dollars, which is proof that coffee farmers can earn abundantly from their sweat. We are a value chain development project. We, we do coffee from seed up to, to cup. We do nurseries. We have our own plantations. Then we process ourselves. And after processing, we roast our coffee and we export it ourselves. So um, th th we are involved in the, in the, in the whole chain. So the money that comes uh, back, it goes back, 100% goes back to the communities to support them. So when you, we train, you go back to the communities and we teach them, call it a coffee start from the garden up to the cup. So we make sure we are with them uh, along with the value chain, teaching them what to do. Not only is the 2,500 Farmers Association able to support farmers to sell their coffee jointly, it also provides employment to the youth who coordinate activities along the stages of the coffee value chain. Uh, after university degrees, we go to look for jobs in the Kampara. Uh, they, we leave our mothers struggling. They don't access the market, they don't know how to market. Then we said we should go back and support our own. As the demand for this unique coffee brand continues to grow, the farmers in Western Uganda are earning well from niche speciality marketing, which has blended tourism conservation with coffee. Gorilla Highland Coffee members have come to realize and appreciate the benefits of the joint marketing initiative that guarantees them a good market for their coffee.